Real fears from a false alarm. Reports of an active shooter at the Kenner Walmart sent shoppers running out the door. Most shoppers, but WGNO's Jordan Lippincott met one who wasn't going anywhere. Shortly after 12 p.m. Thursday, Kenner police received several calls about an active shooter inside the Walmart on West Esplanade Avenue. One customer who was getting her nails done at the time called the sequence of events chaotic. The lights flickered and then all of a sudden you saw these people uh, bobbing up and down and, and, and running, you know, active, active shooter, you know, that was said. I said, I didn't hear anything, you know, in the middle of getting my nail. I'm not leaving, you know. Once the store was evacuated, about 40 officers searched the premises. No shooter was found. A Walmart employee said the investigation revealed a transformer blew, making a loud noise. We did learn that there was some electrical issues in the back of the store, which coincided with what people uh, alerted us to uh, that was gunfire. So we're thinking it's, it's probably just an electrical issue. Police gave the all clear around 1.15 and customers who were forced to abandon their groceries were able to retrieve them about 30 minutes later. Some customers say the situation was blown out of proportion and made worse by a lack of communication. We would be calmer if they'd come out and say something about what's happening. I mean, that we're leading, well, something must be terrible because they don't, not saying anything. So, and that's not true. However, police say when it's an active shooter threat, they must prepare for the worst. All these officers have all the equipment they need to make themselves as safe as possible. Um, you're never 100% safe, but that's, that's the risk that they, they sign up for. Jordan Lippincott, WGNO News.